What's going on everybody? How's everybody doing today? Welcome here today to another reaction to a YouTube video and today we are reacting to a pretty popular video. I think this has over 12 million views and it's NBA reporters or just basketball reporters uh, asking NBA players stupid questions. So this is going to be pretty fun to watch because I'm definitely going to forget or I forgot about a lot of these and they're going to kind of pop into my mind again and be like, oh yeah, remember when that reporter said something dumb? Hopefully we get a good laugh out of it. I'll leave a link to the video in the description below. And like always, if you guys want me to react to anything else, let me know in the comments below. And without further ado, let's get into this. Will the Clippers be back here Sunday playing the game seven? What? <laughs> Your feeling about you know, your level of confidence that you'll be back here again. What you think? I, I'm, I'm on the team. What you want me to say? Nah, it's over. I just, I mean, that's what you want to hear? Yes. That's... Come on, man. You've been doing this long enough. Seriously, right? If you can expand upon that. No, nah, I don't know. Everybody in here laughing for a reason. Bobby on the left side. Bobby Stan. Ramos, bottom line. This is for both of you. You have a great defense. They're averaging 104 points a game. You have a lot of offense. You haven't broke 100 yet. Is the problem your lackluster defense, or is it the problems you're having offensively? Lackluster offense. Um, the problem is we're down two games to one. That's the problem. We got to figure out how to tie it up. Doing away with the respectable answer. Can you call LeBron a great father after the Chicago game? What? Yes, he did. Agreed. Wait, who called who a great father? That's the problem. We got to figure out how to tie it up. Tristan called LeBron a great father. Tristan Thompson, okay. Oh, a great father. father. Oh, I thought he's oh, I'm bad. I got I interpreted that that completely wrong. Okay. I thought you said he was a great father to him. I was like, what? Called him a great father. So yeah. what type of parental role has what? he played for you and your teammates? Oh, okay. So you, uh, yeah, yeah. I, parental role? I, honestly, I'm, I'm, you know, he's, <laughs> I don't know how to really answer that question. I'm, He's been a he's been a, a great leader for us. I wouldn't. I good have, answer. Good answer there. Go the leader route. One father. I, that's my dad, Frederick Irving. <laughs> um, but for us, in terms of learning the nuances of the game and also how to win on the court and also how to carry ourselves off the court, I feel like he's been a great influence in, in that role. Man, Kyrie looks so young there. Oh my God. Uh, Dreamman, uh, here's an interesting question. So last year you visited us. Uh, Game three, the no flood, you win. Game four, there was flood, you lo you lose. There was, oh, I can't. And this it. year, you visit us. Game three, there's a flood, you win. Game four, there's no flood, you. Uh, there's a flood. Oh, okay, I think that's what. Oh uh, no, saying. game three, three, there's flood, you you lose. Game four, there's uh, no flood, you win. Brother, so, you, a foul? You, you mean, asked me about the flood in practice the other day, you know, and I um, I I said I pray for the city of Houston. Because oh, oh, okay. So it is a flood. All right, gotcha. Because you don't want to see anyone go through that. I feel like you keep trying to get at like us hitting threes or something, and you're trying to get a controversial statement out of me. But you're not because I feel sorry for the people of Houston. People are losing their homes, losing their cars, losing their lives, losing loved ones, and you're trying to get a controversial statement out of me about the threes we're hitting. I know what you're getting at. But you're not getting that out of me. It's it sucks. If I was from Houston, I'd do anything I can to help the city out. And I'm sure some of those guys are going to do what they can to help the city out. And you saw a donation the other other the other night. It sucks. Stop trying to do that. That's not cool, man. You keep asking me the same question about this flood. These people are losing their lives, bro. Losing their so is he trying to make anymore. it like the flood was like a statistic? Oh, if it floods, they're going to win or something like that? I think that's what he meant. Ain't... That's not probably the best cool. question to ask. You're not getting the statement you want out of me. That's not cool, man. Stop doing that. Toward the end of the game, uh, you shot a three, kind of putting the dagger into him, and you looked toward the crowd, toward uh, Rihanna. Uh, was, was that uh, um, uh, on purpose, or or do you remember that? Or? I don't even remember that. <laughs> well, just to let you know, social media is buzzing about it. Really? Yes. Buzzing. Don't get in that trap. Yeah, bro. don't get in that trap. <laughs> I'm cool. Have fun with that. Is KD married? I don't know. 
He might be. I don't even know if he's married or not. Some sports stuff. I'm sorry we keep asking you about squatting, but well. Draymond and Steve were arguing with the ref when one of them got the technical. It looked like you squatted down. and Were you just stretching there? And what did Richard Jefferson say to you? You, you serious right now? You got to be better. People, people are curious. Come on now, man. <laughs> this is crazy. You got to be better than that. <laughs> people are curious. I really don't have an answer for that. That's the craziest thing I've ever heard. What, what did Richard Jefferson say to you? I have no idea. I don't remember what, what uh, situation you're talking about, but... Yeah. Um, you got to be better, bro. <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah. I like you, but you got to be better. Kenny I'll said. take the compliment. <laughs> did you guys lose this game, or did the Jazz win this one? What? <laughs> this, this is the classic. Did you lose, or did the Jazz win? What are you talking about, man? Well, I'm out, man. I think it's tripping. Oh, my God. I thought that was, like, an edited thing. Yeah, that's, like... <laughs> <laughs> Shaq, let's just say that a uh, snake bit your mom right up here, right in the chest area. Would you be willing to suck the venom out to win the title? No, but I will. <laughs> That's not real. <laughs> no way someone <laughs> said that to Shaq. That can't be real. That can't be real. It's your wife. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Shaq. Oh, no. Good answer. Good answer. <laughs> Quote sheets will be available at the Brian, you may not um, like this one, and I'm not thrilled asking it. I'm obviously trying to defuse this a little bit, but um, it appears that you... I feel like that's just a, just don't ask it. If you're going to say you're not going to like the question to a player, just don't ask it. Unfollowed the Cavs on Twitter today, and it's it's caused quite a stir. Why did you do that, or what what would go into that? <laughs> Next question. Next question. Um, under, you've had 38 assists tonight that's a season high what can is this something you can take forward to the next game uh i don't i'm i'm i'm, I'm done mark last question lebron mark schwartz i wonder like what like obviously lebron didn't want to answer that i wouldn't say that was a stupid question but like yeah why did he even follow them i would like to see like lebron was like ah, i want to keep my following uh account or amount low or i was doing it on follows for you and they were spamming my feed he would have been good to said something like that didn't have to mean like oh i won out of cleveland I don't know. I feel like that one, like, he could have answered it or something like that. CSPN, from listening to everybody's reaction to the play at the end with JR getting the rebound, there's still confusion about whether JR thought the game was tied or, the way, or whether he thought you guys were ahead. From where you stood on the court and from talking to him after the play, what do you, what's your reaction to it? What's your version? What do you mean, what's my version? Well, did he think that the game was tied or did he think that you guys had it salted away? How do I know that? Or did you discuss it at all with him at the end of the play? No. They asked me if I talked to JR about it. I said no already. I knew it was a tie game. We, met, we, we was down one. Um, George Hill went up. He made the first one. We got the offensive rebound. You know, I thought we were all aware of what was going on. That's my view. So I don't know what JR was thinking. I don't know the question that you're trying to ask. I was just trying to see if you, you knew exactly what his state of mind was. Did he think that you guys had it won or did he think he was trying to make a play? No. Not sure. What do you mean I'm not sure? No, I don't know his state of mind. Did you know if he knew the score? All right, this question's going on way too long. They should have just moved it on. Oh, this is when he left. I forgot. Ah, oh, that's what this is from. Ah, oh, he's got the, the suit shorts on. Um, yeah, I guess that's, he's probably just annoyed because he was like realizing everybody was going to ask that, not his 50 point. I don't know if he had a triple double, but yeah, I think he had 50 points in this game. So I'm getting annoyed too. <laughs> he just walks out. Then this is such a funny meme when you speed it backwards and it's like, we're back or something like that. It's so funny. It's so weird without masks. Probably not to people. twist your words or read too much into what you say. Jason Whitlock. No. Is it Whitlock or McIntyre, the, the controversial? I don't know. But being around young players energized you. That's not a statement about maybe you'd like to see some young players on your team? Wow. That, <laughs> you know what? That's a Bikram yoga stretch. You stretched the hell out of it. Good job. Good job. I'm not even going to answer that. That's just silly. Next. <laughs>
Do you think Harden is a max player? Where would you rate him as a shooting guard in the NBA? Um, James Harden is a, is a great player for our team. Uh, he does a lot of great things for us, and um, he's going to continue to do that for us. No more questions for you, bro. <laughs> Are you supposed to the case where you guys just need to defend home court at this point? Uh, well, I mean, are you a smart guy? I think so. Sure. I think so, right? So if we don't defend home court, what happens? But yeah, I know. That's what I'm saying. I'm asking you. Well, yeah, then you guys are looking at getting swept. <laughs> All right. So the answer to your question. Nah, I'm good. Oh, I can't even hear what she's saying. Food, wine, I'll be all right. <laughs> How do you think he was handling just the frustration later in the game of, of you know, the way he played or didn't play in the first half? And, and, and as things kind of, in, in the fourth quarter, it seems like, you know, he, he wasn't, things weren't breaking for him. What's your question? Well, how, how do you think he handled the frustration? Um, I mean, it seemed like there were a lot, no, I mean, a lot of things that were yeah, I mean, going against uh, him tonight. I mean, he's a competitive guy, man. So you, you felt like he had, they missed a the goaltending call, which they did miss, and then they said so after the fact. So he kind of lost it there for a second and went went crazy. You know, he didn't pick up a technical foul or anything like that. But I felt like he played with the intensity that we want him to play with, you know, in the second half. Does that does that say something though? That I mean, you guys scored on the possession anyway, and that he's he's still frustrated enough that he's. Uh, you know, not letting it go. What are you writing? A temper tantrum column, Andrew Bynum thing? Okay, so I, I didn't know who they were talking about. I was like, oh, Meadow Will Peace. Uh, they're playing the Nuggets. Like, oh, at first I was like, oh, Mel, but now Andrew Bynum got gotcha. he, 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 Everybody has moments where they blow up like that. Where they, you know, he didn't cost us anything. He didn't get a technical foul. Do what? Do you still feel the same way about practice? Do I what? Do you still feel the same way about practice? <laughs> Obviously, you didn't get it. I thought I played it up. I thought I I really, I didn't think that I would ever get that question again. I thought that I would. See, you might not have seen the documentary, so I'm going to give you that. I'm just going to watch it. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to just, you know. Hope that you didn't you didn't see it, but I, I it, you just heard me say I was the MVP. The, that's the best player in the whole world. You think I can't be a, I can be an MVP without practice? So is AI saying Giannis is the best player in the world? Technically, it would be controversial. Right, you have to be a bad motherfucker. <laughs> There's a video. Oh no, that's such a. Oh wait, did I? The MVP without practice. Right, to be a bad motherfucker. Wait. <laughs> There's a video of like... Oh, the Baylor one is so good. It's the rebounding one in Torrey Prince. I don't know if it's going to come up again. <laughs> okay, for real, man. Thank you. I didn't know well, if you well, wanted to clear anything up. I didn't know, clear yeah, anything up. I didn't what know what you were saying. What video? There's a video that the Thunder Twitter account tweeted out. What video? It's a video of you putting up a shot pregame. Mm -hmm. Ran off and yelled something. I would something never say tunnel. no other man's name like that. For one. Thank you, Kyrie. What do I look like? I was talking to my... Trainer's daughter. His name is her daughter. His, his daughter's name is Jamie. Thank you, Jamie. I'm tired. Of, I ain't even about to keep going on there. I'm, I'm about to keep my spirit up because I'm not about to even involve myself in no dumb stuff like that. But next question, man. <laughs> Steven, second time in three games. Uh, you guys really struggled when Russell went to the bench. You were out there for part of that. What goes on when he goes to the bench? Why is Houston so successful, and, and do you sense that, that they sort of get an energy boost just from him going out of the game? Hold on, Steven. <clears throat> I don't want nobody to try to split us up. We all one team. Regardless, if I go to the bench and Steven's on the floor, if I'm off the floor, we in this together. Don't split us up. Don't try to split us up. Don't try to make us go against each other. Try to make it against Russell and the rest of the guys, Russell against Houston. I don't, I don't want to hear that. We in this together. We playing as a team. And that's all I Very mean. good job by Russ there. Right, Very good it. job. Yeah, Russell, I'm not trying to split you up, but twice in three games, you guys have not played well at all when you've gone to the bench. That's fine. We, and say, I'm just say, trying to figure out what's going say, on. Say, Russell, you ain't played well at all. Say, Russell and the team is, haven't played well. Don't say when Russell goes out, other, the team don't play well. It don't matter. He could pull up the net ratings. Would be your Clean seeds. That may, that may be, Russell, but I asked Steven a question. Well, and it's, it's a legitimate question. you. Next question. It's a legitimate question. Next question. Next question. What? Next question. 
Is it just no, I think we're gonna keep the microphone. I had a question for Steve. I had a question for Stephen, and it, it wasn't answered. And I don't understand if Stephen wants to say he still hasn't said anything. If he wants to say I don't want to answer that, fine. But next question, please. Damn, okay, yeah, that was awkward towards the end. But man, I forgot about some of those. Like, I recognize some of those, but some of those I've never seen. I've never even seen that shock video. That was hilarious. But yeah, that is going to be for me, though. Thank you for watching. I love you guys, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.